we oh good 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 i was making sure the notification went out oh lovely today we are back with more sucker for love i'm excited i'm excited <laughs> oh that was my necklace hitting my desk sorry <laughs> it's fine it's fine okay With that, well, maybe a little bit further ado. I just kind of okay. Cool. We do have the capture. Hello, 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 hello. Oh, I also wanted to celebrate because uh, we hit our goal of 30 followers yesterday while we were offline. <laughs> um, we hit the goal, and um, and so I wanted to do this. With you guys, we are okay. It won't let me do it on the widget. This is a little embarrassing. This is okay. This is a little, a little embarrassing. Um, <coughs> okay, <laughs> it's fine. There's a little bit of technical difficulties. It's all right. It's fine. Okay. We are, what am I doing? I just want to set a new goal with everybody. What did I just do? Okay, I pressed a button that I shouldn't have, but it's okay. That's fine. <laughs> That's fine. It's fine. Alrighty. Wow. Wow. Okay. We are setting a new goal today. Oh. We are I just wanted to set a new goal with you guys. Just wanted to set one with you guys while you were here. Because I thought that would be nice to do. <laughs> Alrighty! I'm excited. I'm, I'm very excited. And I want to take a moment to, to, to thank everybody. I appreciate it greatly. And then we are... What am I? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, yes, that's where I put the chat box. Chat box wasn't in the place where I usually have it, so I was confused. Wait, are we loading or are we doing a new one? I'm... Nope! And the music is, like, bumping. I'm so excited! The king in yellow approaches. This is exciting. <laughs> In a world terrorized by slavering shadows and tentacled nightmares, something as innocent <laughs> okay, innocent as an additional star in the night sky may be the most prophetic. Premonition, premonition of doom. For wherever the lurid golden light of planet Carcosa shines, the long wicked shadow of the king in yellow is cast. Behind that mask lie, lie, e mask? lie echoes of decadence and disorder, masquerades of limitless, limitless cruelty and hideous laughter in equal part. And... Of all the poor devils seduced by lavish promises, don't make fun of me! I will eat you. Don't. <laughs> Hello, welcome, Red. I'm so glad you're here. Sleepy's making fun of me! Lavish promises of the God King's court. The favored victims of the King's sadistic amusement. 
are followers belonging to other deities. Huh? What? Where? Huh? Did I zone out? I was... What was I doing? Damn, I'm having a hell of a brain fart. I can't remember for the life of me what I'm supposed to be doing. Everything feels so hazy. I feel that. Was I going to work? I am standing outside after all. Yeah, that's gotta be it. The sun is setting, so it's probably around 7 p.m., which means I'm going to be crazy late. Fantastic. I guess that's the beauty of... Ah. Hello? Me? There we go. Oh my gosh, sorry. That's the beauty of working nights. I can't use the excuse that I overslept. Slept. Yeah, boss, I slept all day. Sent at sundown. That's why I'm six hours early for my shift. Huh? <laughs> That's a good question, Red. Huh? <laughs> Those sound like the church's noontime bells. It's high noon? High noon. No way. They must be doing some special evening service or something. I can clearly see that it's the golden hour right before the sunset. I'll just have to ask someone for the time I'm way able to work. What, what? What? Did I just say? If it's not too late and I can really hoof it, okay, I'll just get chewed out instead of fired. I'll still have to deal with being sweaty, but I'll figure that out when I get there. Do you have, do you not own deodorant? Oh, someone's coming home. Perfect. Fingers crossed that I'm not absolutely screwed. Yeah, that looks like a person. Hey man, sorry to bother you. You wouldn't happen to have the time on, on you, would ya? Bubble buyers. Hello? Hey, uh... Hey? Is this guy standing far away because he's not wearing deodorant? <laughs> Is this guy ignoring me? Normally, I'd say whatever and walk away, but he's... Unfortunately... Standing in the only stairway off this floor. The only way to exit this conversation is to shove past him, but this guy is giving me such weird vibes, I don't want to go anywhere near him. You guys can't hear the audio. You just heard me talking. I really hope I didn't say anything about the music while I was... <laughs> Okay. I don't want to go anywhere near him. The longer I look at him, this guy seems more and more suspicious. That odd posture. He's slowly swaying in an uncanny, disturbing way. The collar of his shirt looks filthy, stained with splotches of deep, deep browns and reds. Is he bleeding? Does he live here? This is the top floor, and I thought I've met all my neighbors. There are only four apartments up here. My only choice is are to go inside and call the police or to walk past- Why would you call the police on a man who's just standing there? Or to walk past this freaky guy. I don't have the time to wait around for when the cops show up, so I'll- But just as I take a step, I kick something weighty with my shoe. It's bright pink with gold accents. You little cocksucker, I told you, do not come in here if you don't want to join the party. We are dating- my headphones popped out. We are seeing- we are dating hot monsters, and you are being impolite. Out, out. <laughs> no, don't say that. This is an exclusive club. Get the fuck out. Okay. My dog wanted out. Um... And I, t I told him, I told him before stream, if you want out, now's the time. And he want, went out. And then, five minutes before stream, comes in. And is like, hey, you know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe I do, maybe I, maybe I do want to see some hot monsters. I'm like, sick. That's great. My yelling was a joke, by the way. I'm just kidding. 
I love you. I felt really bad because I called him a cocksucker. It's okay. It's it's a he's a dog. He's fine. This is a book. Lanetta! But I died. The world ended. It did. And it was worth it. It was totally worth it. The shock freezes me in place. And because I was so distracted. Oh my god! Shit. <gasps> Fuck you and shit ass. Fuck off, dick. Ah! I duck inside my room, slamming the door in the suspicious man's face. Oh, I don't like this man. Fumbling with the locks in a panic, I managed to turn the deadbolt. That's good, but if it's a monster, then why? If it's a monster, if it's a monster, then the monster's gonna go into your room. The monster's gonna go into your room, and you're fucked. Mm-hmm. I died. I, I, I didn't read that last part. I just clicked. Sorry. Um, I died. I definitely died when I performed the final ritual. So why am I still here? Where is here? It's your apartment. Are you okay? Walk to my room. I have nowhere to run. Oh, ah, that's lovely. Oh, look at that. That's yeah. That's lovely. Yeah, yeah. This guy just made me shit myself. Better be smoking. Are you Lanetta? Lanetta! I already yelled at my dog, and I don't want to, I don't want to yell again and just remember. If Lynetta was here, she could explain this. And she could, because she's a smart cookie. I like cookies. Maybe there's something in this book that can save me. I need to hurry. Come on, come on, Lynetta, where are you? Lynetta, huh? Who is this Lynetta you're trying to call? Is that creepy bitch at work that has my address? Missy? Well, what are you doing in my room? I just so happened to overhear you saying, Lynetta, where are you? You sounded like you were in trouble, so I let myself in. Of course he did. You're, like, because she was described to us as a person that works with us. Yeah? As a person that works with us. That gives us expensive shit. Expensive gifts, and then has our address. That's weird. You're gonna tell me that that's not weird? That's weird. How did you even get in here? Your window is open. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you here? Are y'all hearing this? Uh, this is not hot. This is this is nine one one. No, it's not. In either way, I'm on the top floor. So how? That that's a good point. We're on the top floor to talk to hot monster babes. Unless she's a hot monster babe, something's not added up here. Lynetta sounds like a girl's name, right? Oh Lynetta is obviously the girl you stood me up for, isn't she? Is it standing someone up if they just show up at your house? Ah, uh, probably not. What is her deal? I knew she'd be pissed I slammed the door in her face, but not so much that she wouldn't notice any of the things obviously wrong here. That's, yeah, that's, that's fair. Why doesn't she care about those freaky things stalking me outside? Or that my room is full of evil idols and ritualistic tokens? I can explain all of this stuff. Let me guess. Accursed devices used to channel eldritch magics and do the bidding of outer gods? Yeah. Yeah, actually. That's, that's me. Spot on. You're a very smart lady. You're very smart. Yeah, that's exactly right. Uh, did you just randomly guess that? Uh, no, I've just been playing coy. Mm. I know exactly what you've been doing. Then why the fuck are you here? You know what this is, don't you? No. Ah! Yes, I do. It's a golden version of my book. The book I used to perform rituals for Lynetta? Hers looks way more ornate than mine. Considering I ended reality with mine, I can't imagine how dangerous hers must be. Well, did I really end reality? I'm so confused. Wait a minute. The sky that suspicious- that- wait. What? The sky. That suspicious man outside. They all match Missy's 
book. How did I make that connection instead of throwing her the fuck out of my house? Is she making all of this happen? I don't know. Can we leave? Can she leave though? God, when I expected her to do something crazy, I thought she was just going to show up with a hatchet or something. Well, she showed up. That's for sure. I think that's, that's enough. Missy, look, I'm sorry. I just got wrapped up in something. Please don't. Sorry. You're sorry. Why are you acting so afraid of me? Because you showed up at my house? I didn't give you my address. <laughs> Could it be that you know what this book is capable of? Do you see my room? Yes. <laughs> I know all too well. But I also know that these incantations take at least five seconds to pronounce. And that's if she gets it right on the first try. Which I wouldn't. So my so worst case, I have five seconds. To stop her. If I dash my ritual knife behind her, I might be able to kill her before she does something terrible to me. If I can distract her, I might be able to buy myself some more time. How are we here? The, he's skipping over a whole bunch of shit that I'm just confused. I'm like, well, how, how are we here? Missy, look, I'll do whatever you want. Anything? I can be rather demanding. That was a terrible choice of words, my guy. Name your price. Don't do that. So bold. Yeah, uh, unfortunately. In that case, I have three commands. Oh, God. Am I a fucking genie? Number one, you'll address me as your highness from now on. So when I come home, it's welcome home, your highness. This isn't... Wait. Is she my girlfriend? Do we live together? Because la last time last I checked, we didn't. And she was just a person at work that showed up at my house. When she comes home, yep, she wants to move in, but that means whatever. It's not like I'm going to have to actually follow through on these. At least one of us is about to die. Okay. As you wish, your highness. What else? Okay. You'll quit your job so you can spend every waking moment catering to me. You're one and only. Are you going to pay the rent? Cause, that's fine. I'm fine with that, actually. Sure. Whatever. Just a little bit more than I'm sprinting- What? What? Just a little more. A little- What? Hello? Just a little bit more until I'm sprinting range of the knife. And number three. You'll obey every order and whim I have, absolutely, without question. Oh, that feral rogue! Thank you for the follow! Thank you very much! Welcome! I feel like we shouldn't obey her. I feel like this is a bad idea. And it's gonna end badly. Let's find out together. Do you agree to my terms? Sure. Absolutely. Absolutely. What? <laughs> okay. Absolutely, your highness. <laughs> I suppose if you will do whatever I ask, then there's no need to use any of these dreadful spells. No! Not at no. Why would you need to? Yeah. Yeah. Especially one that's like, that's like, like, that, like we're talking shit with like deities here. And she's like, you're obeying everything? I, well, we don't need stuff. Like, no. That's a terrible idea. As a matter of fact, I believe you can help me with them. Here. Huh? She just handed over her book without a second thought. Yellow energy pulses and crackles from my fingertips. My tentacles, I guess. Is she... Is she not here to hurt me? Oh, confused. I'd liked you for a long time. I gathered. And you're a capable bookkeeper. Thanks. Handsome to boot. Thank you. There's no reason we can't simply work together. I mean, well, okay, no. Flattery might work. But I'm gonna try really hard to make sure it doesn't. After all, <laughs> a relationship based on threats of violence no. and fear is no good, right? Not at all. It's not good. I appreciate that you trust me. Yeah, right, right. We narrowly escaped with our lives just now. 
How? We don't know what she was gonna do with the book. <laughs> She's liked us for a really long time, apparently. So... But something's bothering me. How does she remember I stood her up in the reality that ended under Lynetta's awakening? I don't fucking know, man. How do you remember? <laughs> and how did she get in through my window? I doubt she was able to climb several stories dressed like that and then pass through my locked win window without breaking it. Yeah. Uh-huh. There's only one possible answer. That she's, uh, 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 like, mm, yeah, mm-hmm. All right, your highness, I'm ready to enter my lifetime of servitude to you. I just have one small request first. We don't get requests. Bing. Yeah, see, like, I, that's what I figured. Could you tell me what this is? Jesus. Are, right, okay. Huh? Your Worcestershire sauce? What about it? Uh, so you're an eldritch god, disguised as a human. What? How did you <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. We are the dumbest motherfuckers on the planet? That worked? I- That's fair. Isn't it obvious? No human being can pronounce worst- Worstesh- Where- Worstesher. 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 I just said it. Would it be spelled like that? That's a good point. That's like that's a good point. After all this time I wasted trying to seduce you in this lovely form. I mean, it's kind of working though. I like the eye patch and your hair is super cute. I love the dress. And I would really appreciate if you told me where you got it, actually. Yeah. You should try it using your eldritch form instead. I would have fallen in love immediately. Okay. Well, what? maybe. <laughs> oh. What? You think cosmic entities? Uh-huh. Are attractive? As a human. Uh-huh. 3D women are fine, but fourth dimensional girls with non um mm -hmm, geometry are smoking hot. Geometry. Geometry are smoking hot. Okay. I I should have finished that, but I didn't want to. They got curves I can literally get lost in. <laughs> if I had known that you're attracted to my cosmic godhood, I would have just led with that. Uh-huh. Oh my god, this scared me. I love your dress. Very. I can't say that word. I get tongue tied, sleepy. And I think I'm in love with her. And I want her dress even more now. She's gorgeous. A bonafide eldritch king in my room. Oh man, all my fantasies of smooching eldritch horror are coming true in eldritch royalty to boot. The king in yellow. That sounds familiar. I can't remember why. My memory of my other existence is kind of fuzzy. What do I remember that her followers... What I do remember is that her followers tend to be incredibly violent towards cultists loyal to other gods. Like Glenetta. Shit. I kind of got swept in the moment and almost forgot. I already pledged fealty to a different god. This reality or not. That's true. Lynetta is a babe. Oh, wait. I'm sorry. I'm already involved with another god. I'm I'm following Lynetta. I know, so loyal, so faithful mm. and devoted. That's why I want you to be my follower instead. Ah. In exchange for serving me, I shall grant you anything you desire. Well, power. Whatever that rotten witch Lynetta offered you, I can double it. Cause I want uh... Please, and thank you. She promised me a smooch. Then I shall... What, what, what? <laughs> like, she's so cute. You handed over your reality to her? For a singular smooch? Yes, I did. Are you mad? No, I'm quite happy with it, actually. You heard me. So, you'll match your offer, though. I... I suppose... Hmm. If that's all you're selling the world for, then a smooch... Of course. ...can be... Uh, ...arranged... Yeah? No, uh? No way. 
You promised to double it. That's two smooches. Hold on a minute. No? Two of them. Not on the lips. Yes. I just usually my followers ask for inordinate wealth, mm. questionable fame, and ah. influence, hmm. or some lavish indulgence. Ah, don't need that. Nobody's ever dared to ask to kiss me before, so. Oh, they're missing out. Sure. She's blushing. <laughs> For real. Do you really want to smooch me? Well, yeah. your terms are amenable. Shit. Suffice it to say, I'll expect you to perform mm. your scenes flawlessly in exchange. Oh, as I do. Scenes. I uh, guess as I don't do. The gave you contains the script for the king in yellow. Hmm. Huh? You mean this spell book that I was so afraid of? Is just a damn play? This thing is just a playbook. So are all the pow- So where- Wait, what? Uh, hello? Where are all the power invoking rituals? Rituals? Is this some sort of peasant <laughs> that I'm too rich to understand? I don't fucking know, dude. Yeah, I don't know rich people jokes. Casting hocus pocus in a cave. That's a great film. We have a little class. To invoke my power, my play must be performed perfectly. And you know what sucks? I was a fucking theater kid. I perfectly. I don't always get rituals. I have scenes that are the first time that happens if I watch my lines or I get a scene wrong. Your performance will receive a scathing review mm. in the Carcosan Times publication. Mm. And you'll also be killed. I think the first one might hurt more. Uh, one time, I was doing a play and. Everyone forgot all their lines in the same scene, and so we just walked off stage. Gulp. Well, we didn't walk off stage. We improved off stage. I'm getting close to those smooches. <laughs> I'm sorry. No matter what. Break a leg, dearest. Oh, I probably would rather. I'm scared. <laughs> no. Oh god, we have to read all of this. <laughs> Guys, I'm a good reader, I promise. I read all the time. Okay. Greetings, stranger, fortune fellow. Tis a party for which I bellow. Excuse me? I know how to say bellow. Do I have to do it slower? Uh huh. Are you kidding me? Are you slash SRS right now? Stranger, fortune fellow, tis a party for which I bellow. Excuse me? Excuse me? That's kind of rude. How much slower do I have to go? Oh my god! Yep. Mm hmm. It's a party! Like a fucking snail. Ah. Okay. 
I swear to fucking god. Why? What am I doing wrong? I'm reading the line. What am I doing wrong? I'm reading the fucking damn damn line. Are you? Oh wait. Are the lights supposed to be off or something? Like, it's not telling- <clears throat> <clears throat> Okay. In view of the city- We're supposed to be outside. In the- In view of the city, we're supposed to be goddamn outside. Right? I- <laughs> I didn't read. <laughs> Greeting, stranger. Fortune fellow. Tis a party for which I bellow. Ah! Greeting, stranger, fortune fellow. Tis a party which I bellow. I invite the king in yellow. So come ye in. Sleep is gonna make fun of me. You tell? Yeet! With my masks upon you, to my masquerade, yet till thank you. Ah, oh, which one is it? My masquerade, until he may come to lost. Yet till, <laughs> oh, for us, there may be still. I'll just alternate. Fuck! Yet till, yet till. Yip! Like, like a and dog yipping. Yip! Wholesome, you'll instill from the souls of poor Yatil. Why attract so much ill will? Are we supposed to be talking that fast? Because I can do that. <laughs> oh! Fuck. Uh-huh. Oh, that scared me. I thought I had to do... No clue. Apparently she does, thank God, because I don't. Okay. That is what I must seek. See hidden somewhere amongst the meekly. Tis one invitee I seek. He shall all my stakes undo. Tis the king in yellow whose great wealth I shall accrue. When his shadow passes through, wealth will come and I to I and you. Lo, your plans shall surely languish. Mm. That's my favorite Eminem line. Mm -hmm. I can't stop. Yeah. Mm hmm. Wearing this expensive clothing, pardon from my family's loathing, lasting till I'm decomposing all my friends whose strife I've caused. Yes, preparing for this night, their forgiveness is the cause. They shall all be proud because I had fought the king to, brought the king to us, not fought to us. That'd be a different story, I think. I'd be dead. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I thought we were being dramatic and slow. Thank you. Yeah, oh, shucks. I thought we were going slow and dramatic, but I guess it was fast and dramatic. So, um, you know, I can do that. Why, thank you. That was actually pretty fun. I haven't gotten to flex my acting chops since high school. You're no stranger to the stage. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Is it the fact that I'm in TM? <laughs> is, is that the... <laughs> yeah, I was a theater kid. <laughs> my school did Macbeth. No. I... We didn't because... We didn't say that on stage ever. Oh, absolutely. Mm. Was I? I was tree number four. I wasn't tree number four. Yeah, it's the best damn tree you've ever seen. It's not. Never mind. 
Don't worry, I forgot it's actually in Megmeth. I thought you said you were a tree. Acting. Oh, you are good. Oh, thank you. Hey, hey! What's happening to you? Don't fret, dearest. Something is simply passing between my planet light and your bedroom. A cloud, perhaps. A cloud? You know the proverb, wherever the golden light of Carcosa shines, the shadow of the unspeakable one is cast? It's a literal rule. Ah! Oh, good to know. I can only be wherever the light of my planet star Carcosa shines. Mm. In other words, I can't reach you at night when you're not standing in natural light or if anything obstructs your view of Carcosa. Noted. That explains why Missy had a weird daytime curfew. She literally vanished from the sunsets. What a Cinderella blah, 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 that curse. That also ex Cinderella, I can't say fucking so okay. That also explains how she got in my room. My window may have not may have been locked, but the curtains were open, allowing the light in. Oh, and I just closed them. So she can't get in my room if I close the curtains. Aww, I was quite enjoying my time with you. I wanted to stay a little longer. I can turn on the light. Yes. Oh, I guess it's our planet. Sorrow. It may be some time until your sky clears. Until then, I bid you adieu. Adieu! Mm. Oh my god! Guys! 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 We gotta kiss! And she then she leave. Left. Looks like I have one hell of a choice to make. Another hasn't been summoned yet. Nestor is stuck out. Esther, shit, is stuck outside for a moment. So I have a moment to collect my thoughts. Between Lynetta and Esther, who do I want to smooch? Or maybe more accurately, accurately, who am I more afraid of? Do I stay with Lynetta, or do I follow Esther just this time around? She is offering twice as many smooches after all. I need to make my choice. If I want to stay with Lynetta, then I should focus on casting spells from her book. If I want to smooch a stair, then I should open my window again when the clouds clear and use the stairs book. And if I try going for both, well, walking down the middle of the road is bound to get me run over. As long as they aren't both in the room at the same time, I should be safe, right? Oh, man. What am I going to do? Either way, I need to talk to Lena. She might be an avatar of world editing cal calamity, but she may be able to help me get my head straight. Unfortunately, that's not possible, especially playing this game. Speaking of my head, why does my forehead feel kind of sticky? Okay. <laughs> Are we going to look in the mirror and freak the fuck out again? Because we're a model? <laughs> Cute. Hmm. Oh! We're calling her- yep. Okay. Turn off all lights. Red fire candle. Yep. That's red. I should probably remove that, since it's not her. Yep, those are closed. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Are you protection? The dark is dangerous. Yes, it is. I'm not saying that, because I don't think I could. Well, I could pronounce the first word. I. Oh. I was going to say it didn't tell me to put on the necklace. It tells me to put on the necklace quite. Act like. Says it right. Spells it right out for me. I forgot to draw on captions, whoopsies. My bad. I don't know what happened. Okay. Hey, Lynetta! It's nice to see her, despite everything I've been through so far. 
Yeah, I don't know what happened. Sure, she may have ended reality where I, I was from. Yeah, I saw those uh, stream elements. But she never lied or deceived me in any way. I can... Pull it up here, probably. Hmm. Yeah, sorry about that. Sorry about that, Feral Rogue. I don't know what happened. She told me up front that it would happen, and I did it willingly. That said, I'm really glad you're here, but can you tell me what happened to me? To that world we dated in? Oh, <laughs> the, the comments about, um, about the ladies were too spicy? <laughs> Got it! <laughs> That's okay. A moment of weakness. I mean, you know, look, look, looking at these eldritch beings, like, of course. I get it. You're good. <laughs> we dated it. Yeah. Fell to me. Nothing there exists anymore. Like a dream that ends. Oh. This is like thought. Only then why am I still here? Why did I deserve to survive when the rest of that reality didn't? Oh, darling, don't make me say it. It's embarrassing. <gasps> oh my god. Guys. Okay, be cool. I think she likes us. We gotta be cool. You're still here because I'm. Mm -hmm. I'm still dreaming about you. Everything in existence is being dreamed oh, about by at least one Eldritch God. So as long as you're on my mind, you'll exist somewhere. Aww. Well, okay, then I don't. I was gonna be like, she destroyed my planet, and I don't know what the Yellow King's gonna do, but. But, I'm kind of. No. That's actually kind of sweet in a terrifying cosmic way. What would happen if every god stopped dreaming at the same time? What if you woke up all at once? Everything. Including all of the gods, would cease to be. You're dreaming about each other? I don't blame you. I mean, I get it. And that can just happen at any time? Nah, don't worry. <sighs> There's about 50 of us total, so the chances of all of us being awake at the same time are low. Noted. Noted. Hmm. Gulp? There's only like 50 of you and all? Can we smooch all 50? She probably knows Miss Sarah very closely. Mm -hmm. Kind of a big family, huh? Yeah. Family. Do you, do you know Esther? Esther? Esther. Hey, darling, I thought I told you not to mention other women while we're together. Especially not my sister. You guys have like different dads? Cause like, or is this is like a, is this a recessive gene? Or... Hmm. Sister! Uh, I can't stand that little boyfriend stealing! Ah! Hmm. Hmm. Mm hmm. Don't, uh, have a great relationship with her? Absolutely not! We've been fighting over planets and followers for eons! Mm -hmm. It wouldn't be a stretch to call us nemeses. Hmm. <sighs> Thanksgiving this dinner must be awkward. <sighs> you... That was the dumbest thing I could have fucking said. You think Eldritch beings celebrate Thanksgiving? Darling, what's that on your forehead? Well, um, what's what? It looks like a lipstick mark. That's not from another god, is it, darling? Nope. It's from my mom. If it is, well, you die here. Hmm. Nope. Nope. She left a kiss mark on my face when she kissed me. 
I I did check I did check the mirror. I clicked I clicked check three times. It's um uh, what? Uh, come on, man, just bullshit it out. Something. <sighs> it's ritual paint. Ritual paint? Yeah. Yeah. It's one of the steps I need for your one of your rituals. <laughs> that was the. Are you fucking kidding me? She knows her own rituals, I'm sure. It's a good thing we took down that fucking portrait. Oh, really? No. Yeah. Which ritual? I, I can't say the names of them. I'm not very good at saying names. Let's get the sauce. It's gonna scare me. It's a secret. I'm going to pretend that this lipstick mark came from a human girlfriend. So that I can spare you. Uh -huh. But from now on, if you can't <clears throat> another god, I swear I'll stop being so sweet. Okay? Hey! Uh -huh. You wouldn't care about a human girlfriend? Of course not! Why would I care about that? That's true. When it's a race against other gods to amass as many followers as possible, expecting your followers. Oh, whoops. We celibate is a bad mood. For Grammy Roxanne, it's actually a requirement that you start a big family. Or you get excommunicated from her following. Mm. Grandma Roxanne. Oh, I'm sure you've heard of her. She's got the most followers out of any of us. She's the black goat of the woods. Or the mother goddess of fertility. Mm. The fertility goddess, you say. No funny ideas, mister. There's no telling what I'd do if you cheated on me with a family member. Ah. Uh. Uh-huh. Yeah, that's fair. Go. As, like, as if I... I don't know about you guys, but I think I would be pretty done. I think I'd be like, let's cuddle and, like, be good. Stare, stop, what? Yeah. Looks like the clouds haven't cleared yet. I won't be able to see her right now if I wanted to. For now, I should work through Lynetta's spells again. Eldritch hand saved my ass last time, so I better cast that one in case I'm unable to talk again. Shh. Listen to myself. What the hell is wrong with me, man? I don't know. Pretty. Okay. Um, but here's a thing. Um, hypothetically. If there's a mouth on my hand, then how, how is, um, is Star gonna react to that? Is Star? Is Star? How, fuck, fuck this shit, dude. <laughs> yep. Mm-hmm. Like a bathroom. No robes or amulets. Ritual knife. Sick. Okay, I'm not tempting to say that. Lamanberg? Lamanfrig. Ah. Gaio? Shakiri, were you? Shakira, Shakira. Shit. Still as nerdy as I remember. Lamanpa again! <laughs> yes! In this reality, this is just my hand now. Forever. Dry for my liking, but mm. we could totally have a date date. Why don't you open your window? Let a little light in here? No! I don't think I will. No, wait. Is she want to do that? What do you mean? I mean, don't you want to shower first before you go out, like last time? Huh? Why would you suggest that? I'm sure that there's a reason that you're thinking of. But my reason is, like, do you, like, because you have, a, like, you have tentacles on your face, which, like, same, dude. I feel it. Like, look at me. I also have tentacles. But, like, you gotta clean more often. Because otherwise you just smell like fish that's been in your fridge for three days. Oh, no. Don't tell me. Do I still smell like the ocean? Yep, that's exactly what I was saying. Just a tad salty. Heavens below. Mm. I'm so sorry, darling. Okay. It's all right. I get it. I also, I also have, I'm, I'm all 
also like I'm like an octopus, you know, I don't get it. It's all the same, but I get it. Mwah. That was a close one. She opened that window. Stir would have come. That would have been a goner. Looks like the clouds have cleared and Lynetta's out of the room. If I want to date a stir, it's go time. Otherwise, if I want to stay with Lynetta, I need to go make absolutely sure that window is never open ever. It's time to choose. From this point on, my actions will have consequences. Chat. Yeah. You know, gotta gotta scrub between all the tentacles. I gotta do what you gotta do. Alright. Let's let's go with Lynetta for now and we'll come back. We'll come back to uh talk more to Uh-huh. Um <laughs> Esther. I hope I'm saying that right. Performing the this ritual after a stir's masquerade will have consequences. Are you fucking kidding me? I already, I already performed it, didn't I? If you hear or see something strange, it's not in your imagination. Be ready. Proceed in total darkness, no lights, no candles. Ensure their images appear in no way in poster or tapestry. Wear a ceremonial robe and ritual necklace. Wear a mask or headpiece to distort your features. Have a ceremonial knife on your person. Always remember the second step on the previous page. When all is complete, chant something about humping. Okay. Mask, headpiece, yep. Ritual necklace. I have it on already? Yes, I do. Let's go. Okay, okay. Masquerade's different. Okay, cool. Okay. God. Thank God. Okay. Uh, complete darkness. I hate doing shit in complete darkness, dude. You just said, like, let's see what they said on the previous page. It's. Damn, stream elements. Are you okay? What the hell is your beef with that feral robe? Something about the dark! <laughs> what the fuck is Stream Elements doing? Damn. What the hell? I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. Damn. Okay. Yeah, so the dark is dangerous. What? What the hell is happening? I don't know why it is so upset with you. Okay. No. Okay. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm so sorry about that. Okay. Well, I guess Automod just, like, doesn't like you, I guess. Okay. No lights, no candles. I feel like this is dangerous. Because it said before that... This is scary! That's fair. Why didn't you call me handsome in the voice thing? I wish you would have called me handsome. My mouth, I can't move it again, just like last time. Okay, calm down, focus. If I can control my hands, then... Hey, hey. You're learning to control your eldritch mouth so soon? Yeah, I'm just that cool. I'm getting the hang of it. Seems I still have my muscle memory from the last reality. Good. Oh, oh, try saying something in Rillian. What? I can't even say that word. Nah, no, I'm not saying that. No. I don't want to accidentally do something. <gasps> oh, that's so sweet. You learned to say I love you. We must have been studying, huh? Yeah. 
Yeah, I'm pretty fluent now, right? <laughs> what? Well, in yeah, we'll this, would be a dangling participle error since you started the sentence with ya yeah instead of ya yeah, yeah. That's fair. And since you and I are intimate, you don't need the gin suffix. No need to be so formal with your girlfriend. Oh my god, guys, we're your girlfriend. Guess I still have a lot of learning to do. How do you- um, Damn it, it's actually really difficult to speak English through my hand. Ryu, Ryu, yep. It rolls off the tongue in comparison. Hand tongue, that is. How do you speak human lang languages so well? Actually, most of us are hyperpolyglots. You can't get people to worship you if you can't communicate with them. That's fair. Really? What else do you know? English, Mandarin, Spanish, French, Arabic, ASL, Parcel, <gasps> Elvish, Under- Parcel time! <laughs> oh my god, I know! She was like, you did so well. Mm, not that well. Like, okay. You can calm down. <laughs> hey, you made some of those up. All languages are made up, darling. That's true. Can you hear the love in my voice? <gasps> she tore out the page! I know, me too. I did Spanish for a few years. Um, I wanted to take ASL, but she tore out the breakup page. <laughs> Lanetta? Yes, darling? That is so cute. <laughs> I'm just checking, but you haven't tampered with my book, right? What do you mean? Can I give you a big hug? This Eldritch Embrace spell. It looks a little bit different from the other rituals. <laughs> how strange. Yes, how strange indeed. I want to smooch! That's awesome! That's amazing. Many, many, many a language. That's more than I know. I, I should learn ASL. I think it'd be very beneficial for me, too. I just... I see how hard you're pushing yourself to make it through these spells for my sake. Yes! It does me a huge favor! It does... What? Yes, it does make things for me. And I very much appreciate it always. And she is so but damn maybe sweet. We could use a break from the real rituals, <laughs> so I could spoil you a little. I'm like you cannot see me, but I am twirling my hair right now. Like actually, maybe I can hear it, but I'm twirling my hair. <laughs> That's actually pretty sweet of you. <laughs> but there's no time for breaks. Not even a quick one. What are we gonna do? I can't lose sight of my singular goal. Smooching ya. Well, alright. I'll leave you to it then. Thank you. You're leaving? There's something I need to work on. It's probably <gasps> nothing, but... But she's leaving? I haven't seen anything strange lately, have you? Besides... A, a god in my home? No? I've seen plenty strange things lately. Out of gods, hands with mouths. Beyond the usual strangeness. A little. You haven't noticed anything watching you, have you? Well, I actually. It's kind of awkward, but. Like, there's a few people watching us, like, right now. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, just Twitch chat, but they're cool. They're cool. I promise. Like, they're cool. Okay, guys, be cool. They're cool! Yeah, they're cool. Hmm. I. No, I. Okay. No, I promise they're cool. Sorry, I guess I'm being the strange one, huh? Well, I guess it's not. It's like a reality TV show, I guess. I'll just be right Just back. think of it like that. Stay safe, okay? Okay. You too. Cutie patootie. I'm gonna turn on the light. Cool. It's 
Honestly, Deep Foxy is a great mod as it's red. Dark Communion. She's so fucking cute. Are you kidding? That is the fucking cutest shit I've ever seen. Performing this ritual after a stir's banquet will have consequences. Let the room be well lit. No robes or necklaces. Have the offering on your person. Is the offering the turtle? I'm assuming so. Well lit. I can't open the window. Food! Om noms. I understand. Yeah, I mean, like, I guess when you're... Yeah, that's that's definitely true. When you're dating, like, like an eldritch god, though, I would imagine that, like, you'd just be like, Hey, babe, this person is bullying me? Can you take care of them? Yeah. <laughs> so, like, I don't know. I think we're good. Have the offering on your person. And then we're chanting this. No, I, the first time I, the first time I saw the hand, I was like, ah, okay. <laughs> I was like, I mean, yep. Well, she knows that I'm seeing her already, right? Yeah, I turned, oh, yeah, I turned on the room lights, didn't I? Yeah. Oh. Whoops. I didn't. Oopsies. I thought I turned on the lights for some reason. Oops. <laughs> Delicious. Just as perfect as last time. As long as we keep finding each other, we can do keep doing this forever. I'm down. I like that. Do you remember the last time we did this? When you couldn't speak back to me? Yeah. I do remember. So, you know what happens next, right? <sighs> yeah. I don't want it to happen next, though. One last ritual. And then we say goodbye again. But we'll say hello again, as too. As take as much time as you need. I'll wait as long as it takes, darling. <laughs> Could be so exhausted. <laughs> God, mood. Gonna take a nap before you. Well, end everything. You know me so well. Hmm. But don't try anything while I'm sleeping this time. No, not this time, but next time I will. I know what you did. She... Okay. Who let the secret out? Because... We had... Okay, chat? Who told her? Because <clears throat> this could... Hey! No, 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 I'm not, I'm not scared. I'm not scared of her. I'm not, I'm not scared of her. Take it off. No. What do you motherfuckers told her? Fuck off! No, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. I'm sorry, I love you. Right before our date would have ended, you betrayed me. That was in one of the realities, though. Not all the other one. I think that there aren't consequences between realities, darling. I stand corrected. Mm. <laughs> I've already dealt with that pesky breakup spell in your book, as I'm sure you've noticed. Yes, I did. And I'm so glad, because that means we get to be together forever. So just take the straight and narrow path of loyalty in front of you. Huh? We can keep doing this forever. And ever. 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 I'm down. Ever. You're cute. Hmm. I'm down. Can you get the lights for me again, darling? Yes, I can. Look at her! She's so cute! Okay. We need the ritual knife.
Yep. Mm-hmm. Lynetta, my love, my heart. Lynetta, you beautiful soul. Lynetta, fuck you. Lynetta, my art, my muse. What? I need to talk to you first. What? What is it, love? What is it? What if... What if we didn't complete the final ritual? Guys, are we back in? What if I stayed to sleep longer? So we could have a little more time together. Just you, me, lingering in a doomed world, alone. Like an endless dream come true. Doesn't that sound nice? It does sound nice. I predicted it. Because it does. <gasps> oh, that is a word I can't have on my thing. That's that's a word I can't have. That's a word I can't have. That's that's a word I can't have. <laughs> I have it on my screen. <laughs> I can't have it. It's okay. No. Yep. We'll we'll just upload this one really fast. <laughs> I said it anyway. No! What the fuck is wrong with us? We were finally going to be together forever. We would have been so happy. Why did I do that? This reality is doomed. You said it once. The dream has to end eventually. If you keep a dream going on forever. It has to become a nightmare eventually, or worse, it becomes a reality. Take a look at the world around us, and take a good look at me. Is this what you want our reality to be like? Of course not. But I dream of being with you forever. Can never come true. But... We can be together for a short time. Forever. But... I'm not ready to say goodbye again! Why can't we just stay for good? Why can our time together only be brief meetings and long farewells? What if we're saying goodbye forever? If I'm your dream guy, then there's no way this is goodbye forever. It's no big deal. You can always dream of me again. Darling, please don't go. I can stay asleep a little longer. I can. I'll be right back. <laughs> We're not saying goodbye forever. We're saying hello forever. It's okay. I know. Oh, my love. <sighs> Thank you for giving me a dream wonderful enough to remember clearly. Let's betray her. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Oh, that's so fucking sad. Are you kidding? <gasps> My heart. My heart. No. with us <laughs> me 
and an enclosed room with with a mirror. <sighs> Guys, you have to be in a full room with a mirror. She's she's in that room with the mirror. Do we try it? I guess we can. Masquerade mask, elegant robes, ritual knife. Yep. Elegant robes, ritual knife. You have to be in a room with a mirror. And they're gonna break her fucking heart. I can't. I think I would rather see her be sad again. Yep. All right. Looks like everything's in place. I feel all gussied up. Even for me, this outfit's pretty loud. That's fair. But even so, the beauty of this whole ensemble is as a Love that for us. If Lynetta is showering in here, I better move with a stir in the other room. All I have to do is stand where the planet's light can reach me, and... I already know what you're going to say, Your Highness. Yellow is more color than mine, but I still look pretty good, right? Coming up well. I'm impressed. You'd be presentable before my royal court in that. Ah! <laughs> it's pretty snug fit. The mask almost feels alive, like it's molding to fit my face perfectly. Quite the opposite, dearest. Mm. Your face is molding to fit the mask. Ah! I feel a twist of metal thing in my temples. It's stuck to my face somehow. Ow! Ow! It really won't come off! <laughs> I may have failed to mention that we reenact the play with deadly accuracy. Mm. From this point on in the play, your character never removes his mask. So neither shall you. Uh. This surely shouldn't be a problem um. for someone who is planning to be my eternal servant. Correct? Fuck! Blink anymore. My eyelids are stretched to meet different and different material. Yeah, eye holes. Yep. The mask in your face I just messed up. One. Your every pore is now gilt and gold. Oh my god, Linda's gonna be so sad. <laughs> what do I have? Why do, what, do I have to wear this to work? Yeah, I when I see family? When I see Linda? Do I have to wear this to work? When I see family? When I see Linetta? Wait a minute. Those strange people outside. They'll have masks stuck to them too. Too. Are they past followers who obtain Asterius servants? Is that going to be my face? My face is cuter. I'll say no. My face is cuter. It's prepared. Interior, well lit. Okay. And we are speaking and hoping, pray that Lynetta doesn't come out of the fucking room. Welcome, company, is much cherished. Cher what? Cherished. May my loneliness thus perish to this evening, and we shall share which would be wasted by myself. No attendants have arrived tonight, alas, besides thyself, but I'll be beside myself when the king reveals himself. Don't. Okay. hands upon my bodice, for before you stands a goddess. Know this guest of goldenrod is merely the first of the night. Let us drink to your great wealth and family and life oh. until your afterlife Thanks. all be yours once you arrive. Mm. Yet, until my schemes may flourish, we shall haunt my empty fortress. Let us dance with a whirling dar dervish what? Blah, while we feed our appetites. By the morrow, we shall know if the king came tonight. Midnight marks the final chime. Until that comes, there is still time. Graciously obeisance, demonstrate a courtly patience. He declines no invitation he receives upon his court. All who live in doomed Yatil will know without report. The king arrived by your escort. Prophecy of grim 
Thank you. Thank you. Taking a bow. Taking a bow. An immaculate performance, dear. Thank Mr. you. Bravissimo. Thanks. There's only one more scene to reenact, and then this world will be mine. How fun! I probably should have asked before we got into the final act, but this place is a tragedy, right? No, it's not. The ending is actually quite hilarious. I love comedies. That's actually a huge relief. What happens? Your character is slain and all of his wishes come true in an unexpected way. Ah, <laughs> that's so funny. His ambitions of greed, influence, uh. and fame. He dies penniless, alone, and infamous. But I don't want any of those things. Wait, my character dies? I'm going to die? I thought you said it was a comedy. It's merely tragedy from far enough away, Tyrus. I love that. Is she implying that she thinks my death would be funny? I get that she's an outer god, so human morals don't really apply to her. That's gotta be cruel for her. No way I can go through with that. Sorry, I don't want to die again. I anticipated that you might get cold feet after learning of your character's fate. Mm -hmm. However, my wrath is terror far beyond a touch of stage fright. Ah. Uh. So, for your sake, dearest, do the fucking scene. Fucking. There, I said it for you. Ingredients from cold storage, red fire, red fire candles. Yep. Hoping and praying. Do not make a mistake or a hungry uninvited guest may arrive. We'll make a mistake later. And we're gonna chant. Hurrah. Yes, I believe this night will do nicely. The room is filled with mouth-watering aroma of perfectly seasoned meat and fresh fruit. There must be a magical component involved here, because I see no less than three of my favorite dishes. It's true, sh strutting towards my bed. Surely you don't intend to merely watch me eat, dearest. No, I don't intend to do that. I don't think she- I didn't think she was gonna let me have any. Don't mind if I do. Yo, that is, like, that's cool. I like that. That's like, I don't know. Imagine being like that filthy rich, like that royal that you don't like eat by yourself. You're just fed. What was that? It sounded like groans of murderous anger from outside the door. Was that from the mass stalkers outside? Or Lynetta? If they've all got masks on their faces, they must be Esther's followers, or even ex-partners. Then their groans were of jealousy? Makes sense. They've been locked outside all this time. I bet they'd kill for a chance to spend any time with Esther. Hmm. Just a moment, dearest. What is the thread count of your silken sheets? At least 1,000, I presume. I don't fucking know. Silk, my blades are cotton. <sighs> Perhaps I'll just stand while you feed me instead. Oh, picky. But uppity. Maybe I'll start with the grapes. Something that'll feed her princess complex. Uh, oh. <laughs> mm, delightful. Indeed. I'm glad. Okay. Hey, think I could have one of these? <laughs> Dream on. My lips have already touched it. If you want an indirect kiss, you'll have to be more clever than that. Good thing I'm clever. Yeah. So you won't be able to. So you won't eat anything my lips have touched either. Of course not. You were eyeing this cream puff, right? Would you like me to feed you a bite? Oh heavens below, yes. I am pleased by this new attitude of yours, dearest. Oh, I casually take a bite out of the cream puff. What do you think <gasps> you're doing? Mmm, delicious. It's so good. I never had anything like it. Let me try. Oh. You want to bite? Even though my lips have touched it? I... I don't want it after all! Mm. Well, if you don't want it, then I guess I can have some now, right? Hey! Hold on! Mmm, it's really delicious. Nothing tastes better than food with a twist of eldritch magics. It's a shame you don't want any of it. Yeah. Yeah, dude. I, what? Hello? Why'd I say, uh, no? No, we're not gonna do that. So what's it gonna be? 
Watch me eat your favorite dessert or suffer an indirect kiss. What was that? I order you to hand over the cream puff. She orders me. Very well, my king. I offer the other half of the cream puff to her eager hands, but instead... I forgot I was hand feeding her! Her lips are insanely soft against my fingers. Yes, it is, isn't it? She's damn cute when she drops her sadistic front. Font? Front. I, well, I can't read. I do more, but I feel those husk staring shell staggers in my back. They'll tear off my head if I let this go on. Shouldn't we save some of this for the play? It'll hurt the performance if we eat it the entire set, won't it? I suppose. Very well. Let us resume the play. Okay. Man, I hope she's taking a long fucking shower. No light besides the open window. Robes and, and the mask. Okay, and we have window open, correct? Hello? Yes, we do. Damn the night, and morrow scornful. Wicked morning, unremorseful. Why tonight must I be mournful for ambitions unfulfilled? After all my preparations, all the daylights I have killed, why is it only us, oh, us only still? Why, oh, why are my wishes unfulfilled? Oh, why so livid if your actions that permitted this result truly befitted to a hunger such as thine? Now your greed is grave and tomb and crypt in which you die, yet within your grease you fry. Dearest host, the end is nigh. The end is nigh. <laughs> Too fast? Are you joking? Are you joking? All right now, I hope you're joking. Hello. I hope you're joking. I did not mean to take that. I went too fast. I already did that. Oh my god. Okay. Yep. Perfect. Yep. Okay. Okay. Let's go. We went too fast last time, so we're not going to go as fast. I swear to God, if it gets me for being too fast or too slow, I'm going to cry. Guest, you've come to mock me for bemusement thou my ha ha hello for bemusement thou was hawking and in so and so in the town you stalked me to watch my schemes fall apart. Strip thy mask, apologize and hastily depart. Leave the leave thee just my broken heart, leave naught else in whole or part. And yellow, whose long shadows on your tail, and whose shadow you're in still. 
I'm having so much fun! <laughs> We're doing it slowly, guys. I love that violin, are you kidding? Ugh, draw thy blade from mine contrusion. My life reaches its conclusion. Cruelty matched by your delusion that you truly are the king. Yes, you would have granted all my wishes, not forsaken me if you indeed were the king. Why would you have murdered me? But I granted all your wishes, I'm afraid. I disagree all alone you are with all of your remaining family. And as vision turns to darkness, you have claim to all you see. And you'll wear that mask and robe for the rest of all your life indeed. And the strong will fall to illness, haunt you too with perfect stillness, and none left alive to witness my ascension to you till. And from the catacombs shall spill the cries of innocence laid still, we heard from lady and from smithy and from throne to peasant mill. Cries unprecedented in the history of you till. Wales, unlike they'll ever be again in dark you till. Set your invitations quill. Brought the king to black you till. I have the biggest. I have the biggest fucking smile on my face, dude. I loved that. Oh, that was fun. Oh, he did great. Is that applause, dearest? The euphoria of a flawless recitation. Hmm. Innumerable, innumerable voices make up the cuckoo. Cat, yep. Mm hmm. Phony of cheering outside my door. Then, hello? Fanatical revelry, screams of terror, and sadistic amusement all admissed. It all admissed. Oh my god, hello? Thunderous applause. The king has come. Smiles, dearest, smiles. Aren't you proud of yourself? Yeah, actually. Why didn't you use a safe sage knife? I'm literally bleeding out here. My blood streams from a gaping wound in my chest. My abdomen is unseen. To ensure you stay in character, call it method acting, if you will. Mm. Oh, with sweet sorrow, the curtain falls. And the show begins. The stage is now set for you to inscribe the yellow sign. Do this, and I will bestow upon you the smooch I promised. A smooch? You mean the smooches you promised. Plural. You said you'd give me two. Even now, that's really all you can think about? Yes. Your world is about to be enslaved by a horror from beyond the stars. That sucks. You're dying from a stab wound. Yeah. And you're worried about smooches? Absolutely. You are an interesting human. I've been told. It is a pity that you'll soon cast away your individuality for me. Mm, I think that's okay. <laughs> okay. Yellow sign is only visible or drawable by those who have witnessed or performed the king in yellow play. Be exposed to the king to the yellow sign after witnessing or performing the play. King in yellow will cause permanent irreversible obsession with the king, her court, and Carcosa. An insane obsession persists after death. If you are content to spend your life with the king, dim all lights, leaving your window open, light black fire candles. This will allow otherworldly images to reveal themselves and draw the shape below without the X. Will we draw it? Okay. It looks like a scorpion, but not a scorpion. Behold the yellow sign. Become my slave, my <laughs> eternal captive audience. Sounds good. An entropy. Hmm. Disorder. Hmm. Where things are built tall. I'm not here to knock them down. Fun. Monuments. Nations. Love that for you. That's kind of fucked up. Some of these husks have wedding rings on their fingers. I steal the hearts and minds of the rich or powerful to break them. 
Ah. Fun. But why me of all people? I'm broke. Because I am the breeze of chaos that knocks down any tower that challenges the grandness of my court. Hmm. Your relationship with my sister was one of those things. Because it was love. Before, I only pursued you because you have a great deal of cloud amongst the Nycolin crowd oh. and shrewd wealthy types. I guess that's true. You would have been an incredibly powerful servant who would have been able to draw in countless wayward souls that meet my standards. Fun. At least, until that reality ended and you undid all of my hard work. Well, to be fair, I got a switch from Lynetta, and that's kind of worth it. All of it's my pretty worth it. That, I had stolen from Lynetta, gone in an that sucks. And I had no choice but to abandon that reality. Fair. There's nothing left to destroy if nothing exists, <laughs> you see. Yeah, I would imagine. But in this reality, I've stolen away her most powerful asset. You. Just as I've stolen every member of my entourage. Okay. Maybe I feel a little bit bad. All the husks, they're bleeding from their chest onto their elegant robes. Just like me. All these people. Why? Why? Because it's what I do. That's a good reason. No, I mean, why are they still here? Aren't they kind of third wheeling? Are Moven here? Kick them out! Huh? I want my smooch. Such a defiant tone. Why aren't you under the effects of the yellow sign? I don't know. Were you unaffected? Did the spell fail? I don't feel any different. You're supposed to be obsessed with me. Well, I mean, I am. Ah, oh, I already was. Since I first saw you, that's why your little spell didn't work. <laughs> yeah. You can try and resist it all you want, but one way or another, you're my eternal slave from now on. Okay. Are you proposing to me? I accept. Oh, dearest, I'm not talking about marriage. Hmm. What I'm talking about is to my every whim, anticipating my every desire, and living solely to please me. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that just sounds like marriage. No, I'm talking about a servitude where you do nothing but kiss the ground I walk mm. on and revere me for all of time. Sounds good. Servitude unlike anything on earth, where you never so much as think of anyone else. No, we have that on earth. And it's called marriage. It's different! Hmm. It's not. It's How so? It means no freedom. Forever. You are only permitted to do as I say. Hmm. Yeah. And it means preparing every single one of my meals for me. Whenever I so wish. It depends on the household. Yeah, for sure. And it means never being allowed to quit your servitude. You'll never be free of me so long as you live. You promise? Until death do us part, even? Exactly. Yeah? Okay, I'm sorry, but you were literally just describing being married. I mean, hey, <laughs> if that's what you want, then I'm in. Let's get married! Cute. You shouldn't. Why not? I, I, I stole you away. I ruined your relationship with Lynetta. That you did. I preferred you from the beginning. That's, uh, I don't know about that. I already broke up with Lynetta in the other reality, actually. Why are you being so persistent? You can't really want to marry me that badly. That. You're just trying to act all smooth, so I give you your second smooch. No, oh, maybe that. Save it for our wedding day. Uh, it, you can't be serious, right? Deadly. Of course I am. <laughs> Fucking love that. Are you kidding? That is fucking phenomenal. Damn. Love that for us. Love. Love. So true. So we Oh my god, there's so many endings! <gasps> Are you joking? 
how the hell did I get there? I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. Let's go. I'm so excited. Yeah. So, let's see. We can do metamorphosis. We can, it'll have consequences. If we switch, let's look. Let's see if we can get around it. So, we can do the math, we can do the metamorphosis first and then the masquerade, I think. Let's do it. Let's try it. Okay. Not your imagination. Total darkness. Yep. And then... Mask, headpiece. Robe. Knife. Lights off. Hello? What did I just do? Put that back. That's not what I wanted. Okay. Let's do it! Oh, whoopsies. Oopsie daisies! Okay. Ah! Yep. Chanting, chanting, chanting. I wish you'd call me handsome. Call me handsome! You can't move her mouth again. You know languages. It's so cool. It's so cool and dope and awesome. Oh, wait. Performing this ritual after Masquerade will have consequences. But there's nothing else regarding that. So let's really quick look at this and be like, aw, so cute. Does she say anything? No, she doesn't. Can we talk to her about it? Lynetta? Yes, darling. Oh. Oh, it's a oh, okay. We needed this the sign up for her to Okay. Interesting. So she left to do something. Um, okay. So we are going to do and elegant robes, ritual knife. Yep. Yep. And then we're gonna look in the mirror to make sure we look handsome. I'm sure we do. Mask to stay on my face just keeps slipping off. That metamorphosis spell must have made my face incompatible. Hi, aren't you in proper dress, dearest? Uh -oh. Just having a pre-show chitter. It's kind of mask kind of tricky with my hands shaking so much. Jitters. Uh huh. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I don't look like a playboy, but I'm sort of nervous in front of pretty girls like you. Dearest, you love your king, yes? Yeah. Yeah. And you would never lie to her, correct? You wouldn't dream of it. Then tell me, what happened to your face? Oh, you see, I try to avert my gaze, but her eye and grasp holds my chin firmly in place. Her long, sharp nails dig into my cheek. I know this is supposed to be scary. <laughs> Unfortunate accident, and an even more unfortunate face. Hey, don't say that! For now, we shall conceal that hideous visage of yours beneath the hood of your robe. Hopefully, this won't affect your performance. Not at all. And in the interest of not having further accidents, you will have my undivided attention from now on. Oh, great. You may express your gratitude to your king. <laughs> Thank you. We're gonna drink some water real quick. Just really quickly. Gulp, gulp, gulp. 
Drink some water. Everyone drink some water. We've been here for a while. We're gonna keep being here. Because we love it. Thank you, your highness. Oh, and dearest, one more thing. Anything. I may not be as barbaric as my sister, but I assure you I can be twice as dreadful. Do not give me cause to demonstrate. Then don't tempt me, hello? Okay. So, I look in the mirror. Let's prepare it properly. Yep. Looks proper to me. And then, interior well lit. Love that for us. Okay. Uh, we'll just read this again. Welcome, company, much cherished. May my loneliness so thou per thus perish this evening we shall share, which would be wasted by, by myself. No attendants have arrived tonight. Alas, besides thyself, but I'll be beside myself when the king reveals himself. Yep. I'm sure it's no different, but you know. Octopus mouth. Oh, we, well, we can't speak. Wonderful. Mm. A perfect. Res okay. You have to go super slow. Like a turtle. Yes. Love that for us. Love it. Love it. Love it. Yay. This clip, this clip. Thank you. Love. Probably oh, should have asked before we got to the final act, but this plays in a tragedy. Yep. We're talking about what happens. Yep. And then we can't perform banquet yet. Um, because performing this ritual after banquet has consequences. Um, no robes, necklaces, has to be well, not that well lit. No robes or necklaces, offering, beautiful. And then I'm going to take this down, actually. Cause I get paranoid. Ah, oh, perfect, delicious. Ah, oh, yes, I remember. Oh, Jesus. Yep. Yep. Don't try anything. Dealt break of spell, power of loyalty, and then hitting the lights. We're gonna look at this first, though. So, hope she's asleep. Sleeping sound. Um, ingredients from cold storage. Yep, we have that. Red fire candles. The king. Do not make a mistake. Okay, we'll make a mistake soon. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, no. I made a mistake. I hate this. I don't want to have to repeat it again. All of it. Like. I 
I already used my supplies to cook for Lynetta. <gasps> All that's left over from her dark communion. You must be kidding. Are you seriously planning on serving this to me? Well, you see. I can explain. Please, do. No prob. I have nothing. I have nothing. Mere leftovers for a king? How humiliating. Yep. If you would serve your king leftovers, who, pray tell, do okay. you find worthy of the feast? <laughs> well. She's on to me. She's gonna figure out I serve it to Lynetta, who's sleeping right behind her. Who would have guessed? I hear heavy chains dragging nearby. I I just got hungry. I skipped breakfast this morning. You ate an entire feast on your own because you were feeling peckish. Yes. So, the person you think deserves to eat before the king does is you? Such self-idolatry is a serious crime against me. God, king, and heiress to Carcosa. Fuck. Apparently, the punishment for blasphemy and treason is the same. Death. Huh. <sighs> what a shame. I thought you had some potential, but you're a totally worthless servant in the end. Mm. Mm-hmm. God, she's serious. I'm seriously going to die here. Wait, 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 wait. What if I did something to appease you? Then would my crime be forgiven? I am God King. All is as I say. If I wish for you to be pardoned, then it shall be so. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Perhaps if you grovel on your hands and knees, I can let you off lightly. Of course. I immediately drop into full prosterity. Yep. Bow. Please forgive me. Let me make things up to you. I beg you. I'm a lowly worm, forgive me! But don't let me off with that harsh punishment first. You... Don't you think you said that too willingly? I mean... I'm just checking, but... <coughs> you're not... enjoying this, right? I'm dead! <gasps> no. Yes. Oh, you shameless pig! <laughs> Tinder. This is what you were about to try to feed me, right? And this will be your trough, swine! Oh? You wanna bite? Even though my lips have touched it? Open wide! And don't drop a single morsel. I won't forgive you if you make a mess on my gown. <laughs> a juice-soaked morsel from the leftover shoveled into my mouth. It feels gritty, with an unusual texture, like it's covered in thousands of small hair. <laughs> Tastes strangely. I can't even begin to guess what food it this used to be. I try to gulp it down before I can taste it, but it's too big to swallow whole. If I just bite it in half once, and small little pieces, I might get it down before I gag. As I bite down, it bursts like a tomato, filling my mouth with a sweet juice. It tastes extremely fruity, sort of pine pineapple-y, even. That is... that is good. It's better than good, it's great! It's godlike nectar, instantly addictive ambrosia. More and more, it's too delicious to have just one bite. It's seriously like nothing else. As soon as I swallow, I feel the immediate effects of withdrawal. My fond memories of any other food fade to utter disgust. The mere thought of ever ha eating anything else makes my stomach churn. I greedily take another bite, filling my mouth as uh, much as I can. The smooth nectar bursting from every bite swims in my mouth, coating every surface. It's so delicious that it's making my mouth tingle. Huh? Did I just bite my cheek? Why do I taste blood? Gore warning! Thank you! Thank you very much, Sleepy! Gore warning, everybody! Gore warning! The dull tingling suddenly turns into a sharp sting, then into an unbearable burning. My whole mouth feels raw, like I'm gurgling acid. It's my whole mouth is being digested. I lurch to spit it out, but my willpower fails me. I just can't bear to spit it out. It's too good. The food falls out of my mouth with a splat. 
as a heap of bloody viscera of Sarah. I don't know. It might be imagination, but I swear I spat out twice as much as I put in my mouth. The horror. <sighs> Wipe away that sour expression, dearest. The next act is about to begin. And everyone will be watching. I know it said the horror, but like after like eating that food, I kinda of feel like a whore. Jesus Christ, that was Riptive shit, dude. Okay, banquet. Huh. Let's look. Okay. Gar warning. I'm pretty sure we know what happened here. No? Ah! Fun. Okay. I don't know which one to do. Because we have Act 3. Is Act 3 the end for her? I th yes, it is. Okay. Let's try it out. Oh, wait. Where did she go? She's gone. She's gone. I'm scared. <laughs> Ritual knife. I'm fucking spooked. Ritual knife. Chant five times. I'm terrified. Lynetta's scary. Oh god, I'm so fucking scared. I'm so scared. She's gonna come back! And she's gonna yell at me! Although I'd rather her yell at me than her cry again. That was so fucking sad. This is so fucking scary, dude. Are you kidding? Oh my god! Oh, Lynetta's gonna yell at me. I would okay, if she cries again, I'm gonna cry. I can't handle that. Wait. I need Okay. Yeah, we were doing that and then I can't I can't be sad again. I can't be sad again. Okay, we got the same ending again. What did I do wrong? I did something wrong. What is the middle? Okay. Yeah, we knew that would happen. Still worth it. Yeah. <clears throat> gotcha. Are the hearts like n like notable? Two out of six endings. Exquisite. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, the banquet. Okay, we're gonna swap. And the reason is after the masquerade. So, why not? Bye bye. Robe, necklace, ceremonial knife. I have it. I need the necklace. 
Oh, and I have the mask on this time. <gasps> oh, she's going to be so pissed. Oh, she's going to be pissed. Wait, do I have, do I need lights all off? No lights, no candles. Oh, bro, I'm fucked. Ow! Okay. Ah! Fine! I'll remove the poster! Rude. Fuck. Excuse you. Fuck off. Fuck you. Okay. I thought I put everything on. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. Jesus Christ. Do I have everything? I have everything. She's gonna be so pissed! You'd be ridiculously pissed, are you kidding? But I guess our character likes when people are pissed. I can't get the original mask to stand over my masquerade one! Is everything alright? Oh no! <laughs> I'm a little afraid. She's finished with her shower? Uh, yeah, I'm just working on my pronunciation. She's right in front of me. Maybe if I bury my face in the book, she won't notice the mask has fused my face. And it's upside down. Oh, are you stuck on a word? I can help you sound it out. Let me see the page. Oh my god, she's so nice. No, 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 I gotta, I, I'm a big boy. Right, right, right. Really? Jesus Christ. Ryluian can't be harder to figure out than English. Apparently, it can be. It would probably be easier to read if the book wasn't upside down, darling. Oh, that, that explains why I couldn't read it. Okay, I think I've got it now. Darling, why are you holding it so close to your face? The font shouldn't be that small. Uh, my eyesight has been going for a while now. I gotta pick up, pick up some prescription reading glasses, but I keep putting it off. I didn't know you need glasses. I usually wear contacts. But you aren't wearing them now? I guess not. I must have dropped them on the ground somewhere in the last reality. Darling. Yeah? Put the book down. Oh. Fuck, I am scared. I'm spooked. That's it, I'm screwed. If she sees this masquerade mask on my face, she'll know I've been meeting with Esther. Think, think, think. Ow. Quick to the bathroom! Oh my fucking god. Well, that door holds no telling if this mask is still on my face when she gets in. So I have no other option. I dig my fingers under the edge of the mask. It feels like I'm pulling my very fingernails off mere millimeters of leverage. This mask feels fused to my skin. I'm taking a large chunk of flesh with every pull. This pain, it's unreal. I'm guessing gore warning. Veronica! <laughs> I would open the door for Lena, no shame. Let's do or die. I take a deep breath and pull the mask forward until my skin is taut and there's no more to give. Then I... Oh, yeah, Definitely gore warning. Oh god. Yeah, I have that marked in triggers. <laughs> Why did you lock me out, darling? Heavens below, what happened to you? I I I can't even formulate thoughts right now. Whatever happens here happens. Is is that why you were hiding your face? No, baby. I don't care about any of that. I'm not so shallow that I'd fuss over what you look like. That's actually really damn cute. Are you kidding I'm me? I'm here because I like you. No matter what happens to you. So don't be so self-conscious around me, okay? What a babe. Panetta. Shh. Just let me hold you. 
I love her. She's too sweet. This feeling right now almost makes tearing off my face worth it. Almost. Just stay right there until you're mentally prepared to continue. I think we're just gonna stay right here, guys. Uh, yep, we're just gonna, like, five hours. No, like, she is so damn cute. What does she think happened? That I fucked up, like, a, a, probably that I fucked up pronunciation, huh? That's, that's probably what she thinks. But, y'all, that is so damn fucking cute. Are you kidding me? Okay. I end up blacking out from the pain, waking up some time later in my bed. The golden mask was nowhere to be found. <gasps> Why can't I talk to her? Enchanted golden dream mask, yes. It's what the mask is! It's the point of the mask is. I want to talk. Yes, Dr. Um, we did the thing. Just... It's really cute. You haven't noticed anything. Oh, sorry. Watching me. We have Twitch chat. Mm hmm. We already did the banquet. Room be well lit. No robes or necklaces. I can't take it off. Um, I have the offering on your person. Oh. Ah! Uh, I need light? What kind of light? Like all light? It didn't say anything about white. Although it should be implied because Lynetta is my light. TBH. I already used my supplies to cook for Esther. And that's left is and all that's left is leftovers from her banquet. That's no good, darling. It's no good to leave dirty dishes out. Especially after eating so much. Ah! Uh, it's important to take your diet mm. seriously. You should be more careful when your health is on the line. I feel like my life is on the line. Although that might be part of health. I'll remember that. This much food. It's surprising that you were able to eat it alone. Yeah. Well... <laughs> I know I don't look at it, but I'm a big eater, especially with sweets. You're so interesting, darling. I'm learning something new about you every day. Ah, oh, lovely. I can't tell if she's on to me or she's in denial, but I sense I'm in trouble. It just can't be helped if you got a sweet too. <sighs> no, I can't. Do you want me to feed you the last of it? Okay. What the left of it? <laughs> it's no good to waste food, darling. Oh, I ate a lot. No, you're you're in. I should watch my diet more carefully. If you've already eaten the poison, you may as well lick the plate, as they say. That is true. I'm full. Make room in your dessert stomach. She's merciless. Say ah. Ah! Oh, no! I mean, no! Huh? You don't want to eat? I wonder... If this isn't the food that you like, it sounds like you're saying this was for someone else. No. But that can't be right. <sighs> After all, my darling wouldn't no. be hosting communion with other gods behind my back. Never. Right? Darling? Right. Yeah, <laughs> those are dangerous eyes. I've got my back against the wall here. Even if she knows I have to keep up appearances here, or she'll drag me into oblivion without a second thought. 
I reluctantly unclenched my teeth and opened my mouth. A juice-soaked morsel from the leftovers is shoveled into my mouth. It feels gritty with an unusual texture, like it's covered in thousands of small hairs. It tastes strangely. I can't even begin to guess what food it used to be. I try to gulp it down before I can taste it, but it's too big to swallow whole. If I just bite it in half once and swallow the pieces, I might get it down before I gag. As I bite down, burst like tomato, fill my mouth with sweet juice. Yep, we loved it. It was so good. We kept shoveling it into our mouths because it was so yummy. Oh my god, the gore, the horror, know, the horror. When you couldn't speak back to me? Yes, I do. So one has up. You know me. Yeah. I know. Still looks. Yeah, talking about consequences and shit. And we have his heart still. That's interesting. Um. Hmm. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try it. All oh, good. Wait, robes and mask. I'm wearing the mask. I'm not wearing the robes. I'm naked. Well, I'm sure it's lovely show. Mm, very scornful. Wicked morning, unremorseful. Yep. And then, I don't know if it's going to be perfect for yeah, perfection. We gotta perfect this! What if I go from here? No. Hello? Why won't my mouth move? Perfect perfection. It's a good question. I fucking love the violin. I'm sure I said that already. But holy cow, it's gorgeous. Yep. Da 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 Yeah, beautiful. Did it change? Because I have one heart, I have one not heart. Oh, thank you. You're all too kind. Oh, uh, yes. Listen. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, using a stage night. Do this. Even now, your work and your view. Form yellow sign. It's final pledge. Hmm, yellow sign. We'll just do the yellow sign. See what happens, shall we? So. Exposed to the yellow sign after witnessing performing the play or performing the play, King Yellow will cause permanent irreversible obsession with uh, da, da, same obsession, blah blah blah. Content, yep, black fire candles, yep, and then the thing open, and that's all we need. And then the thing below, it looks like a scorpion, but not. Um because for this Oh We got a smooch Yeah That's I I actually like really love this on screen. I love that. I fucking love the artwork in this, it is beautiful. Look, I'm just like, Mwah! She's like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Love. 
perfect. Oh, amazing, amazing. Okay, so we are going to fuck shit up with Uh, da, 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 da. Gonna fuck shit up. Da, 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 da. Okay, masquerade mask, which we can't put on. And then elk and robe with original knife. Burger King. What it is? Um, let's go. Let's go. Who's showering? Lin Linetta? Okay, won't stay on my face. Oh, not proper dress. She gets pissed. We still do it anyway. Because we are our best interior. Well, oh no. Well lit. How did she get in? Oh, well, I guess the lights, huh? Like, from the window. Yep. Perfect. Shun. Ba 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 the lights! Perfect timing. Yes! Love it. Perfect! You gotta be perfect, folks! We're gonna be perfect, I swear on my life! Beautiful. Amazing. Amazing. Beautiful. 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 Immaculate performance. Love for us. And we got two hearts there. So. We are going to perform this shit again, and then we're gonna actually perform it with her because she's all pissed off. Okay, ingredients. Oopsie daisies. Red fire candles. Allow the king into the room. Do not make a mistake. Oh, we already used it. We already talked about this. Oh my goodness, it's so good. Oh my gosh. It's so good. And we looked at it already. We don't need to look at it again, do we? All right, robes and the mask. And no lights besides the open window. Off. Off. Perfection. We have the robes. We... Oh. Well, yeah, we have the robes. The mask. You probably don't need the dagger. Damn the night and more scornful. Wretched morning and remorseful. Sounds like beginning to a spell. Beautiful lights. Yeah. And then we have to recite it perfectly again. I'm so scared I'm going to go too fast and we're going to have to do this all over again. Oh, beautiful. Love that fucking dress, by the way. That is so fucking cool. Imagine if I just switched books in the middle of it. Perfect. She stabs us. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. 
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. I'm bleeding out. Method acting. Yellow sign. Smooch, I promise. Smooches. Wow, that's really all you can do. Yeah. Yep. Okay. And we're gonna do the yellow sign. We're gonna. Yep. Ba 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 Light black fire candles. Dim all the lights. Leaving your window open. Done and done. And then we're gonna draw. The yellow sun. Tell me, does a servant that betrays his master only to come crawling back to collect his reward deserve anything? That's a fair question. <laughs> You'll get nothing from me. Will I take everything from you? That's fair. So, no smooch? None. Not even two? If I wasn't going to give you one, why would you think I'd give you two? I thought I would try. You know, I think I hate people that go back on their word even more than I love smooches. Hate? What's with that defiant tone? You're supposed to be under my control now. Say, you're the embodiment of light from your planet, right? Why, yes, I am. So, in a way, the star, the planet star Carcosa is also you, right? Well, yes, but what could you possibly mean by asking that? It means I just figured out a way to get the smooch as you promised me, even if it means taking this whole planet with me. Carcosa! Yeah. Hey, you're only supposed to cast that once. Carcosa oh, is enough. I was, I was, I was, I was, I was chanting it multiple times. <laughs> ah, oops, it's fine. <laughs> Casting that spell repeatedly like that. I'm guessing I want the planet to hit me. Only brings Carcosa within a dangerous distance to the Earth. But why do something so pointless? So I can kiss you as the planet. That's why. I'm sure. If you keep casting it, Carcosa will move closer and closer to Earth. Don't tell me. I am gonna tell you. Are you trying to smooch my planet itself? Yes. Ba 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 ba. But the papa, but the papa. Ba. Yes. Come now, we can be reasonable about this. No. If you crash Carcosa into the earth, it'll be an extinction level event for humanity. Wasn't it already? I'll lose every member of my court that I worked so hard to steal from Lynetta. <laughs> There's no need to do anything drastic. You'll die instantly. Mm, I'm sure. Dying once or twice is a small price to pay for smooches. Don't you like being with me? That was short. Please. Anything for some smooches, am I right? Go! Smooches, smooches, we're gonna get our smooches. We have two more endings to go. I'm so sorry, I don't know what that terrible accent is. I don't know what it is. Okay, so. We're gonna have done both of these. Yeah, absolutely. We're gonna have done both of these things. Okay, yeah, switch! Um... Robe! Away! Headpiece. Robe. Necklace. Headpiece. Knife. Knife. Yes. Necklace. 
No! Anything about lights? Total darkness. Hello? Thank you! And then we go through this. We were like, oh my god. She's like, oh my god. Oh, that's a lovely sound. Dark communion. No robes or necklaces. Room be well lit. No robes or necklaces. Offering. Woohoo! It'll have consequences! Uh, she gets pissed off, which... Why is that kinda... And then we're gonna chant it five times. And da 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 da. We're gonna have a ritual and knife on our person. Gonna put that away. Ba bum bum. And then everything has to be dark, right? I think so. Ba ba ba. Da 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 ba 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 Lynetta, I love you. I love you. Oh no, it's too fast. I need to need to tell her slower. Lynetta, I love you. You are an art. Lynetta, have you farted? Lynetta, pterodactyl. Lynetta, love, light, my sun, my moon. The reason I get up in the morning, the reason I stay on Earth and go to different realities to be with you, only you, never anyone else. Stop! Truth. I knew you were acting so strangely, I was still clinging to you selflessly because I was so, so mad at you. I skipped that part, I'm sorry. I wanted to have the best prom work for a happy future. <sighs> so I thought I could scare you straight. I don't think that's how it works. No, that's not possible. Not here. Not now. You're just not the same person that ended reality for me so long ago. I'm kind of sad. So, let's break up. <gasps> Banana. I'm sorry. Don't be. There's no need to end this reality just so we can have an unhealthy, failing relationship. So, I'll go back to sleep, before billions die, for my sake. But, where do we go from here? What's left after today? Tomorrow, silly. You're taking the book with you too? I'm just giving it back to Moo. It's not like I'll have a need for it. Hopefully this book never finds its way back to your world. For your sake, and mine. I'll handle the book, but if you survive... Oh my god, I almost fell out of my chair. These summoning artifacts? It's no good to keep things that remind you of me, you know? <laughs> Sorry. It's a beautiful day outside. You should open the window. Maybe let in some light. I think for the sake of the good times we've had, you've earned one goodbye smooch. Maybe this is a chance for us. In reality, far from this one. But the best I can do in this one is spare you. You're not going to kill me? No, I am going to kill you. To spare you from the slow, agonizing end. I'm sparing you the pain of being alive when the fog lifts and reality sets in. You won't have to live to see the consequences of the spells you've already completed. At least this way, you won't feel a thing. 
Goodbye, brother. It was fun. She got that kiss. Again, I know I loved that. We have one ending to go, and I'm wondering what the fuck we do. Because we performed. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so we are going to ba 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 ba, and then we'll do that. Does it make a difference if she still has one of the hearts? No, actually, still worth it for real. Does it make a difference? Hmm. What to what? What? <laughs> I am? Oh, I guess I am. Shout. No, she's taking a nap. And then she. Thank you. I thought I did that one. talk to her about it because I talked to her about it and then she goes takes the shower how do I get her to leave hello can I talk to you about what this is ma'am I guess not Does it happen after? I can't... No. And then she takes a shower. And then I did it before, I swear. No, where is that? Is that the one I was missing? I swear I did that. Do that one. I have no idea. What am I missing? I don't know what I'm missing. Okay. Before before we post something, can we think? No, I just gave. Ugh. Can we think before we speak? <laughs> alrighty, alrighty. I think we're gonna end it there because I have no godly clue how we're gonna we're gonna do that. Okay. <laughs> we finished chapter two as much as we could finish chapter two. Hmm. We did it! <sighs> okay.
Okay. Well, I had mix it up and we were going to find somebody to read through that, but I'm not entirely sure how to work it. So, let's see, let's see who's playing, let's see, let's see, let's look. Hmm. Oh, you're totally good. I appreciate that you were here lacking serotonin. I appreciate. Um. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. I, I, yeah, we lois. We lo lois laundry. Lois it. We lois laundry very much. We lois it. Let's see. Lois. Lois. Hmm. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Checking my connections. <laughs> of my big connections. <laughs> okay. Literally me checking my connections is going on to fucking discord and seeing if, if anybody's um and seeing if anybody's live oof yikes that doesn't sound very pog if i'm being honest that doesn't sound great <laughs> looking, we're looking. I'm trying to see. Hmm. <laughs> don't mind me. Don't mind me at all. I'm just, I'm just doing my darndest. Ah, uh, you know what? <laughs> We're gonna... I see, I see, um, a pal of... Oh, whoopsies, that could have been a double sound. We don't want that. We no! Don't want that. Ah! And then we had it. My bad, folks. My bad. So, we are actually going to read... <laughs> Uh, we're, we're, uh, I'm sorry, I saw a girl that on there, and I'm like, oh, man, <laughs> that's, that's a big number. <laughs> we're going to raid Krabby Boy. Um, this will be, oh god, I don't know how many times we raided him. We raided him quite a few times, um, and we're gonna say a happy, healthy hello again, um, cause why the heck not? Let's, 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 you know, let's do it. Krabby's, Krabby is wonderful, he's a great streamer. I really enjoy his streams. He is wonderful. Oh, I unri- What did I- Nope! I- Nope! Oh my god, what the hell is happening? Yep. Shh, 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 shh. Don't L me in my own stream. Shh. <laughs> Shit, sorry guys. I didn't mean to. Alright, we're gonna go. 